Here's seven of our Bhutan hikes. We're currently in Chublutang. After probably about 20 kilometers of hiking yesterday, which wasn't too bad going up and down about three, 400 meters. But I think we're slowly getting a bit more acclimatized, so it doesn't feel quite as exhausting anymore, but it was freezing cold. Again, I don't know whether you can see it. Um, there are a little camp just between two mountains, and I don't know whether you can see it. Everything's a little bit white because it was about minus 10 degrees overnight, probably still below zero somewhere. Um, sun hasn't quite gotten here yet. As you can see, it's still up over the mountains. Um, it's a really nice scenery, but yeah, freezing cold again. And we're slowly getting ready to pack up and get some breakfast. Something chased away all of our horses and the horsemen had to run after them and get them back. It might have been a snow leopard or bear or something else in the mountains, I'm not quite sure. Uh, but yes, there are snow leopards here. It would be pretty cool to see one as long as you know it's not right in my face. But rather unlikely given how shy they are. So today we are going to Rubentang by the Jarela. Jarela is just the name for the car. Up ahead, through there, through the mountain ranges, going up there and across Jarela towards the right, which I think is about 4,785 meters, if I'm not mistaken. Mm -hmm. And then have a day, or well, then reach Robo Tang, and then the day after that is our massive 5,000 plus crossing of some part of the pass of the Shinshela, which I'm a bit nervous about, but also very excited about. And then from there on, it'll all be fairly easy just going downhill more and more as we're reaching into Lara and then into Gaza. But yeah, if we're getting ready to have some breakfast now and hopefully it won't get too cold up on the pass and maybe I'll get some phone reception again so I can actually, you know, send messages and stay in contact with people. Right now there's absolutely no coverage here just because we jammed between two mountains. But yeah, looking forward to today's hike. Shouldn't be too bad, maybe six, seven hours, which is actually a lot less than we usually do. We usually do probably around eight. Um, and yeah, hopefully reach Robolutang sometime around 4 p.m., get a bit of rest, and then next day we have the massive hike, but I'll do another video then. Hey, okay, have one last look around. It's very, very scenic, very good weather we've been having. It's very, very nice view and our little camp right between the mountains. And I will see you next time. Bye.